Well, here we go. Local 4 Locker Room Playoff Edition. Big time games with some big time teams tonight, including a couple in the Western Big Six. The Moline Maroons, they were on the road tonight. The 9 and 1 Maroons took on 9 and 1 Yorkville. Head coach Mike Morrissey and his team, the Maroons, they have been so good this season. Let's check it out. And of course, Moline, they have got their fans there. They're always proud to cheer on their Maroons. Down 7 0 in the first, going for it on fourth down. Riley Fuller. Powers through to convert first down Moline. Couple plays later, Grant Sibley is on the move, and number five is into the end zone, and we are tied up 7 7. The Maroons on defense, and they know what they want, and they want the football. And guess who? Jasper Ogburn pulls it in, and then he takes it inside the 20, and the Maroons are in business. But they go for it on fourth down. Grant Sibley cannot get out of trouble. And the Foxes would get the short field, but the Moline defense shows up again. Adrian Cooper, the ball hawk with the strip sack. Ball's on the ground. Hasten B. Bowie picks it up and goes to work, taken off inside the 15 yard line. The Maroons in business. Couple of plays later, Riley Fuller, not done on the night, takes another handoff, and he is into the end zone for the go ahead score. And it was 14 7 at the break. But in the late goings, this went to overtime. Yorkville won it in four overtimes. We can come back out here. 34-31, Yorkville with the win in four overtimes. That game tied an IHSA record for most overtimes in a playoff game. We're hoping to hear from head coach Mike Morrissey before we go off the air in about 20 minutes. But, boy, what a battle. What a season for the Moline Maroons.